Hey guys, we are on the big island of Hawaii and we're building the newest Dome Gaia design called the Eden, which uses all the Dome Gaia building principles in a slightly simpler, smaller footprint. In this video, I wanna talk about specifically the material we're, we're building it with, which is Aircrete, and why we're building it with Aircrete. <laughs> So here we are inside the Eden. As you can see, this is an exposed air creek wall that we haven't finished yet. So I wanna talk a bit about this. This design could technically be built out of almost any type of material. So why would we use aircrete? Very core to our building philosophy and our designs are methods that are accessible to anybody at any ability level and also can be done anywhere in the world. Aircrete has a few unique properties that are really hard to beat when it comes to that. First off, Aircrete is made out of a ceramic cementitious material. It's made with cement and foam. And so it doesn't rot, it doesn't rust, it doesn't be, it's not eaten by insects or bugs. So this makes it suitable for all climates. Aircrete also has insulation value, which is a great benefit as you're building. You don't have to add extra insulation. It's hard enough to hold up a whole structure, but it's soft enough to make it very easy to cut and carve with. So for example, when we're building a wall like this, Aircrete is incredibly forgiving. We don't have to be precise with anything that we're doing because we can come back and easily shape it. Anything that sticks out too much, we can just cut it right off. We can fill in gaps. So that makes it really easy for a new beginner because because you need very minimal tools and experience to build a wall like this. The forgivingness of Aircrete is one of the best things when you're building with it. And if you're doing unique shapes, it makes it really easy. You can cut it and you can rasp it and carve it to get the unique shapes that you want. The other thing that you'll notice about this wall is that we put our electrical in afterwards. We did have a general plan of where we wanted the electrical, but we didn't need to plan it out in perfect detail. And it was easy to make some design changes after we saw the finished product. With other building materials, that can be quite a challenge if you make design changes and you have to plan it all out. So here we've just come back and very easily with very basic tools, just scored in the places for the electrical conduit and boxes, which will then all get covered up in our final layer. So these are some of the reasons why we love Aircrete. It's easy to make, It's you can do it anywhere in the world. The materials are readily available, it's inexpensive, and it's very easy to work with. One of the questions that people ask is, if it's so easy to work with, then how do you make it strong? Because you can see this is quite uh, fairly soft at this point. When we build with Aircrete, we use a composite material system where Aircrete is the inner core of the wall and we use a fiberglass reinforced stucco on the inside and the outside. And so the combination of that, the best way to think about it is like this, a surfboard, where a surfboard has a foam core on the inside and then fiberglass layers on the outside. If you were to take any of those three materials by themselves, they wouldn't be very strong. The fiberglass would be quite um, bendable and the foam would break. When you combine them all together, they make a super strong structure. And so these walls are fiberglass reinforced on the inside and outside, and the shape of the arch combined with that makes for a super strong structure. The best way to learn about building with Aircrete is to come to one of our workshops. We also have a lot of resources and tools on our website, including all the tools and manuals that you need to get started on your own. So head over to domeguide.com and we'd love to hear about your project and what you're doing. Let us know in the comments if you have any questions about Aircrete that we can answer and be sure to like and subscribe, which really helps us out.